Hello everybody and welcome back to Ruled Waves 2 as Japan. So first things first, we're at war with France still. Uh, but uh, yes, I recall now that you can go up to 12% for your uh, research. That was something that I forgot because um, I played this. I played a lot more of this uh, of the first game, and 10% was the max. So and I I batch record, so there was a, quite a few episodes for people to say I put it up to 12%. I got it. It's they're all batch recorded though, so it just took like eight episodes for me to actually acknowledge that. But that's been done. Uh, but yeah, we are at we're at a, a situ we're kind of in a situation like yeah, France doesn't have a lot for us to deal with. We're kind of just waiting for them to to say uncle. I'm waiting for the UK or for Great Britain and uh, Italy to really hammer France and give us a shot because they did vacate like all of their major forces out of Southeast Asia except for one heavy cruiser, a light cruiser, an AMC, and then nine destroyers. So yeah, we'll have to see what. Uh, what we're going to do here, uh, we're, we're just kind of going along, hoping that we don't start a war with Russia at the same time, because uh, that would uh, leave us kind of open. Uh, but yeah, let's go to um, the next turn. All right, cruiser action. I think that's wrong uh, in terms of what they've said they have. Some ships from our ally joined in. They don't have a dreadnought here. I know that. Okay, is it just an Italian... Is this Italian destroyers? Oh, they have a cruiser division, too. Okay, so what, what do they... Okay, so you've got that one, and then we've got our two light cruisers. All right, what is the Italian heavy cruiser? Four 8-inch guns, 8-inch belt, 20 speed. Okay. Nothing too big, then. Let's see what we see. We're just off the east coast of Hokkaido. Doing a standard patrol in the middle of a rainstorm in the afternoon. We'll see if we spot anything. Yeah, just keep going. Alright, no contact. No. Yeah, they had a heavy cruiser. Oh, looks like we just missed it. Yeah, we passed each other, but the line of a vision was not there for us. Okay, battle was a draw. Condenser trouble for a heavy cruiser. Three new destroyers just came off the slips. British Governor's Office sells us the rights to explosive shells. Quality steel for shells. Sure, we'll buy that. We have plenty of money. So increase to our HE shell damage. Uh, we lost a sub. They sank five of our merchants. We sank one. Okay. Let's see here. Nothing really new. All right. Let's think about this. Uh, yeah, we're building more subs. Uh, we've got a couple more destroyers. 900 tonners. Uh... About ready done this uh, refit for the Fus uh, for the Hazan Haizen the uh, Fuso class. I think it's a refit, is it? Is Fuso already made? Yeah. Ye no, no. This is this is the last of those. Okay, it's been a couple of days, so this is a this is not a refit. This is actually a new one coming off the slips. The last one of that. That's good. Uh. We can stop halting this uh, battle cruiser, which would be great. It's uh, Samson class. We should be getting back into the black here pretty soon. Okay. Still we'll check what we see, what France has got in here. Heavy cruiser AMC. Three light cruisers, heavy cruiser, a couple of destroyers. All right, nothing really new. Just need to keep going here. Cruiser action. Okay. We'll accept that. They decline battle. Okay. New battleship commissioned in the Navy. 
our pre-dreadnought battleship, three new destroyers into the Navy, town government office sells the rights to subdivision damage control, improve subdivisions, we'll take that, we've got plenty of cash, gradual damage control improvement, uh, they're well on their way to understanding larger torpedo warheads, that's good. Uh, we sank a merchant, they sank seven of ours in Southeast and Northeast Asia. Yeah, we need to get a uh, battle between our ally and France. France lost a destroyer. Okay, good. Or heavily damaged, not destroyed. Uh, all right. So we got that. In the Northeast. We, have, we don't have anything in trade protection. Yeah, nothing in Southeast Asia, which kind of sucks not able to deal with that we still can't invade because the distance has not worked out it really sucks i would love to actually invade because there'd be nothing to stop us at this point in all honesty we might be able to actually swing a decent concession in this war all right so we're still not in the black, but we're better than we were. Last of this, the, the Fubuki will be out next turn. And then uh, it'll be two years before, uh, at minimum, two years before anything else is finished. So that's something. Let's go to the next turn. Okay, another destroyer. Uh, counterintelligence believes that Italy has stolen technology... Uh, we shouldn't get upset about it. They're our ally, and they're kind of helping lock down the French fleet. Uh, we sank four, they sank four, but we also sank one from our subs, and we sank a sub, so we actually came out on top for that month's, uh, trade warfare. That's good. Okay. We need to think here. I don't think we can really send our ships anywhere. That's the problem. And the French are not being blockaded, I don't think. So check the Almanac. France has an actual dreadnought. UK's got battle cruisers, or not UK. Great Britain's got battle cruisers. And more battleships. More heavy cruisers, more light cruisers. But they're all spread out, that's the problem. So France is able to not be blockaded. I'm not even sure you can blockade. I'm not even sure AI can blockade another a AI. That's something I've got to think on. Uh, okay. So, two heavy cruisers. What was this design again? Right, this was a big boy. This was a, a super heavy cruiser. <laughs> That we decided to make. Alright. Well, we just gotta keep going here. Not much else we can really do. Coastal raid? Yeah, we'll do that. Supposedly a large battle, but they do not have a lot deployed into this region. So maybe we can get a, a very good... Uh, a very good action here. Independent. I want you to actually battle division. I want you to be a screen for them. Let's go to full speed and let's go towards the target. I want these guys to full speed as well and start doing some scouts. Let's see what we got ahead of us. Battleships will do the bombarding, everything else will just uh, keep them protected. What do we got? Transport? Literally nothing. Alright, let's not go AI controlled, let's go line ahead. Alright. There we go. Shots hitting that merchantman. It's basically gone at this point. It's just that one light cruiser in this division. Okay. Let you go that way. Okay. 
Okay, another ship. What is it? Heavy cruiser, it says. Light cruiser. Okay, there's a gun line of light ships. Yeah, they're not doing so well against what we've got coming at them. I want to see a battleship put, like, a big shell. Like, the main gun shell on <laughs> one of those destroyers. That'd be amazing. Okay, go that way. Well, battleships are actually getting their secondaries in on this fight. Oh, yeah. Let's go down a bit to 10. Let's turn. Squadron max. Turn more. Okay, turn off there. Okay, now let's get you guys down to a really slow speed so that we can just do bombardment. Oh, yeah. Cruz. We'll just have our light cruisers patrol this uh, entrance to Fort Bayard. Oh yeah, they're on fire. Whatever this is. Turn with our battleships. Oh. Yep, we succeeded that. Okay. Let's go to cruise. Head back out. Just everybody starts heading out at cruising speed. And we're out of there. Okay, that worked out. Probably damaged a couple of their uh, light ships, bombarded a target, and took out a, uh, a merchant. Well, we got something over here. What do we got? Let's go to full speed and see what we have. Transport, you know what? Why not? The more things we blow up here, the better our victory uh, numbers will be. Let's just knock out another transport. All right, is he just, is he scuttling himself? I would. There's three battleships, <laughs> literally. <laughs> <laughs> right in front of him. What else would you do? Alright, well, let's start heading out. Yep. He scuttled himself. Okay, two merchants. Bombardment target and some damage on their destroyers that are stationed here. Should be a fairly decent victory. Let's head over to Formosa, where I'm guessing these guys are currently uh, docked at, like where their home base is. Yes, yeah, and scenario. 
Uh, okay, yeah. Three ships sunk. Heavily damaged one of the destroyers. Medium damage two others. Nothing for us. That is a victory. Good. All right, and a vict and a uh, a prestige point. All right, we got larger torpedo warheads. So they do more damage. That's good. Lost a sub, sank a merchant, sank two merchants here, so we won that by five points. Okay. Fuel shortage. That's not great. We are currently in a fuel shortage, apparently. Which I guess makes sense? I don't know. I actually don't know in the early 19... We're, no, we're coal. Oh, well, we're coal, so... Eh... Eh, should be okay. Damn the French. Oh, hopefully it's not a huge deal. Uh, do want to see here? We got three more subs coming out soon. They're coastal subs, so they're not that great, but hopefully they'll do their jobs. Yeah, still got a long ways to go before those heavy cruisers and uh, battle cruisers come off uh, the assembly line. Or not actually being assembled, but you know what I mean. Current range, okay. Yeah, didn't think so. I was just wanting to check. I could, uh, I can imagine being able to invade these possessions, just going straight along the coast. Okay, next turn. Three more subs. Okay, the Heisen has finished her working up. British Comfort Office sells rights whole construction, hydraulic riveting. We'll take it. We got plenty of money. 1% weight savings on hull. Believes that Germany has stolen technology and hull construction. We're not going to push it. Uh, we sank a sub. They sank four of our merchants. We sank one of theirs. It's not great. Operations of our ally Italy had 70 VP. That's good. And no fights for that turn. France still has a couple of cruisers up near our home islands. And they're still stationing two light cruisers and a couple of destroyers in Southeast Asia. Are they stationing anything here? No. Two AMCs there. Italy's got everything there. France has got the bulk of their fleet there. Except one battle cruiser down there in West Africa. It's a little overkill, it seems like, but whatever. We've been at war for almost two years at this point. Fuel shortage is gone, so it was like a bad month there, I guess, for uh, what got knocked out. Uh, merchants that got destroyed, I guess, just... Uh, we're all carrying coal for us. Okay. Yeah, we just need to keep going. We do not have anything else we can really do. Next turn. Cruiser action. We actually have an advantage in this, so let's see if the French... I'll uh, take part due to... Uh, part in battle due to distance close space. Okay. Well, that was one destroyer. We got two heavy cruisers. Fairly decent ones. And yeah, we're now down here in the Anam area. Let's see what the uh, French have got here. What do we have in terms of this? This is the two 8-inchers, and then you, I think, have the four 8-inchers. Not 8-inchers, these are 9-inchers, right? Yeah, 9-inchers. Okay. Let's have you go to max, and let's see what you've got with your other ship steaming up behind and let's see what you lot are okay that's a destroyer those are two destroyers that is a long way to go to base Trying to keep these guys in sight. They're going for a uh, 
Oh, they, they're going to miss that. Okay. This is good, actually. So we're going to... If you go there, we're going to try and bracket these ships. We're going to see if we can catch them unawares. Okay, I think they're going down again. Come on. Alright, we got shots that we we're putting near them. We haven't hit anything yet. Okay, we're hitting them. Come on. Okay, destroyer's been hit and damaged. It's going a lot slower than the other one now. See if we can catch up. Because they're going for that bay. not going to go immediately uh, next to it. We're not going to go, like, uh, parallel to it, because I don't want to get hit by a torpedo. Okay. He's down. Yes, go get some survivors, and then we'll see if we find anything else down south here. Near uh, Cam Raya Bay. Let's see if we find anything. <sighs> Let's go fast. See if we spot anything. Oh, we did spot something. Says it's a light cruiser. Definitely not a light cruiser. Might be the other destroyer in that group. It is now on fire. What's it making? 20 knots? With apparently heavy damage? Uh, I suspect this will be going down soon. Come on. Knock him out. He's gone. Go back to cruise. Detach to pick up some survivors and then uh, I don't see anything else. So let's go to ultra fast and just head on out. Okay. They had a Corvette and two transports, but we still won. Yeah, one up there, looks like. Yeah, a patrol boat. And the transports, I'd... are they over here? Or... No, land targets. Those aren't transports, land targets. Okay. Well, that worked out. Yeah, marginal victory. It wasn't, like, a big thing. Increased our uh, shipbuilding. That's good. So we're at 25,000 tons. Some condenser trouble on one of our heavy cruisers. Enemy has put out feelers at their ne uh, negotiated peace without border changes or operations. We can fight on if needed. A compromise peace is mediated by the USA. There will be no annexations. Okay. So there we go. We have won the... Uh, actually, I might just check here. What was that uh, messages there? They scrapped some AMCs. Okay. 
Uh, yeah. Well, we finished that war. We we got some experience. Now we're going to have to move most of our forces back up to the Northeast Asian area. Uh, so let's see here. Southeast Asia. We'll keep these guys down there. I'm going to get you. I want to move to Northeast Asia. In Southeast Asia, we're going to bring all the battleships up as well. We'll leave a couple of light cruisers there. Most of the heavy cruisers will leave. And I think that's a good squadron. That's a good Southeast Asian squadron we'll leave there. Okay, and all of those will be coming back up to Northeast Asia. So that works. Now we need to, again, think about fighting the Russians. Eventually. Uh, scientists report that they are currently baffled by the problems of better steel quality. Yep. Uh, hydraulic rammers, so rate of fire improvement. Good, good. New research area discovered. Our scientists expect promising results in the new air, uh, new research area, uh, naval aviation, lighter than air. Rebellion has broken out in the French possession of Tonkin. Where is Tonkin? Is, uh, is it the bottom one here? No, no. Tonkin. That would be good for them to lose. I would love them to lose basing area. Uh, that's something we got to think about. Uh, these short-range 400-ton destroyers, I'm thinking we're gonna we're gonna ditch. They're not that useful anymore. I think we're just gonna get rid of them. I'm gonna keep the 500 tonners around for a while, but the 400 tons I want to kind of get rid of. Uh, I know they're not taking a lot in terms of maintenance, but. Uh, I guess they couldn't be useful just for trade protection. We'll keep them there for a bit. They're they're not worth it to, to get rid of right now, I guess. Uh, let's see, though. What is... Hmm. These heavy cruisers, we'll keep them around for a while. They're okay for raiding. These light cruisers are pretty good for raiding as well. Okay, we don't really need to toss anything out right at the moment, but we we, are, we do have to think about our budget in a bit. I mean, it's going to be a while before, be a couple of turns before we have to really worry about it, but we can halt a couple of construction uh, projects to get uh, uh, back into the black. Let's go to the next turn. Uh, during a coronation review, there has been a collision between one of our ships and a ship from Italy. Unfortunate accident, they're an ally, so we're not gonna we're not gonna bust their balls. Uh well on their way to understanding TNT bursting charges. Okay. Uh nothing new. Some new dread dreadnoughts and battle cruisers being commissioned by the US and Italy. Yeah, not bad. Let's go ahead and let's halt construction of you. And halt construction of you. And then let's look to our oldest three battleships to be, yeah, to be mothballed. Are mothballed, or do we just, can we just put them in reserve? Reserve fleet, not mothballed. Put them in reserve. My phone's going off. Okay, and then... Uh, in Southeast Asia, and you're taking a lot, but then again, you're also being repaired. Uh, we'll go with that for right now. We, we, got a, we bought ourselves a couple of months. <clears throat> but, we're going to have to end the episode here, because we're out of time. And we'll have to figure out our budget here pretty soon, because it is getting low. It's getting low. We had a lot of money for a long time. Uh, but yeah, thank you for joining me for this episode. If you liked it, please leave a comment down below. Hit that like button. If you want to support the channel, hit the subscribe button down below. As well, take a look at the description down below where I link to my Discord and my Patreon page. I'll see all of you in the next episode. Bye!